Guess who's back? Back again. Mikey's back. Tell a friend. Hey everybody, here we're with another video for you guys today. And today we're going to be looking at our Avengers mock um, that we built on top of a mountain in our Lego city. But before I go any further, let me just say, if you like this video, any of the videos on the channel, please... Like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, let's take a look at our Avengers Tower Mountain mock <laughs> after the intro coming in. Now. Well, last week on the show, things got a little tense. You know, we were talking about this mock that uh, I was designing, and I got tense. Oh, we both did. It, you know, uh, King Ollendorf called it the mock of divorce. <laughs> I don't remember that. So I must have been seeing red. Uh, <laughs> the mock of divorce. So I, I made a little uh, clip for you guys to to see how our mock of divorce has has going. So don't call it that. I don't like that. <laughs> That's not acceptable to me. Here is our Avengers mountain, mock. and here's our Avengers tower mock that we recently put together here in our city. And underneath it, um, this was the big thing that I wanted to do was put like a mountain in and put the tower on top of it because the original set that this Avengers was, uh, we got two of them and it was a little underwhelming. We missed out on the uh, bigger Avengers tower and we wanted some kind of Avengers tower. And so I wanted to beef it up, you know, add a little bit more to it. And so I thought maybe putting a mountain underneath it would be the way to go. And I figured since I'm going to do that, might as well make the train go through it, you know, so because that'll be fun. And uh, let me just say that actually doing the rock formation and everything for the mountain was not easy. Um, my, I tip my hat to all of you uh, mountain builders and stuff out there. It's not easy. And there's the platform that Iron Man lands on and takes his suit off because uh, we ended up getting the Iron Man Hall of Armor set and came with the Tony's car there. And so that's where Tony's going to park his car. And, but what I was saying is, you know, doing the rock formations is not easy. Um, this is the best that I could come up with with the parts that I had available to me. I didn't order any new parts for this, just use what we had in our collection. And, you know, I'm pretty satisfied with how it turned out. Um, you know, it could always be better, but hey, you know, uh, like I said, doing these mountain mocks are not easy. I tip my hat to all you mountain builders. But then let's take a look at the inside of the actual tower and this came together really well. Uh, Mrs. Mikey J did most of uh, this uh, interior here and you know um, put the additional you know blocks and bricks and everywhere and then we got the the hall of armor down there below on the other side of the mountain. That was her idea as well to put that there and I think I think this uh, view of it looks great. Um, I'm really happy with the way this turned out, considering these are just a couple of small little uh, Avenger sets. And then here is the Hall of Armor, the Iron Man Hall of Armor, and our complete collection of our Iron Man. For now, you know, we'll probably be picking up more as time goes on, but. Uh, our, our son is real satisfied with it and he's happy with having his little Iron Legion. And then here's a little look at the train, how it can go th through the tunnel and everything. And you can see these are just random bricks that I used. You know, nothing special. Stick in there just to kind of, you know, try to hide it as much as I could. Use the parts that, you know, we don't like as much. Um, and then cover use good use good parts on the outside and here's a little bit closer look at the interior of the Avengers Tower again uh, Mrs. Mikey J did uh, did all of this and I think she did a great job especially considering you know the sets that we had uh, to work with here 
And here's a little closer look from this angle at the mountain and Tony's car and everything. But, you know, I'm pretty satisfied with the highway the mountain turned out for now. You know, it's probably not complete. We'll probably do some more fiddling with it as time goes on. But, you know, this is the way it is as of right now. So, figured I'd show you guys it. And I like how the, the bridge goes, like, connects to the hill almost you know so it, it's like gives one like big giant like tunnel to go through and here is like the look from this angle of the city and you know we got the the jazz club will be coming here and so we'll be rearranging some of the modular buildings in the near future but i wanted the avengers tower to kind of stand out well, anyways thanks for watching everyone <laughs> Made him giggle. It was a shawarma mart. A shawarma mart. Yeah, the uh, see, uh, cause like I said uh, last week, um, that that we missed out on the Avengers Tower, the the nice one, and you know we just got a couple of those smaller ones, and you know we wanted to make like like an Avengers kind of tower, and it always felt so. Well, small. Th this is how it felt when I put it when it was in our city, and I looked at it compared to the rest of the building. <laughs> so yeah, I had to, I had to do something with it, and you know, I I, I took inspiration from other YouTubers by putting uh, and yep. some make believe YouTubers as well. Make believe YouTubers. Yeah, I've seen people do it. What having a train go under? No, a that's and... not what I'm talking about. But uh, <laughs> uh, that, but it, uh, <laughs> I'm happy with the way it's come together. I, I, again, as I said in the video, um, doing the rock formations and stuff is really a lot more challenging than, than I think people realize. Um, that that's what that's what like. Uh, Got me into trouble, but uh, <laughs> we don't. We won't. We won't revisit that. We'll one. rehash that. One. Um, but it's by no means done. Um, no, nothing uh, is ever done in Lego. In she already opinion. had some ideas to make it better and stuff, and mm -hmm. yeah. I, and I was. Oh yeah, because I was thinking about getting rid of the colored because you have that black wall. Yeah. So I'll make it wider. Well, like Thunderlogger says, I can't do rock formations. Can't do stuff that is random. See, I'm ready. I, I want to go back to pirate ships. And stuff. <laughs> Go, uh, go that's play with more, your ship. That's gears. more of my speed. And uh, I can't. I'm. Ha I have a hard time with rock formations as well. Like, like I was telling him when I did my uh, my grand hall, I put rocks underneath that to raise it up, and I tore that thing apart so many times that I broke my grand hall. You know, so it just you you got to tear it apart a couple of times and put it back together, and tear it apart and put it back together. It's it's a it's a frustrating process. <laughs> and he can't handle it. Hey, thanks for watching. And don't forget, we got merch store. If you want to take a little piece of the show with you, you can get it right here. We got everything. You want some Mikey J stuff? We got the Mikey J Productions for you. So take a chance and stop by. We'll take care of you.